Hello everyone, welcome to this Honyuan Qigong video. So in this video we're going over two different exercises. So the first one that we're starting with is called the circular extension and contraction. So the idea with this, you want to focus into your center, center of the lower abdomen, and then rotating from that center. So you're going to inhale, come up the back leg, back of the body, exhale down the front of the body, down the front leg. So you can start with a little bit smaller circle and then gradually get a little bit bigger, staying connected through your center. So inhale up the back, exhale down the front. And you can reverse, inhale up the front, exhale down the back. So drawing up from the bubbling well, the bottom of the foot, and go all the way up through the crown of the head and then all the way down the back through the back foot. So you have that circular circular uh, movement of energy through the body. We're doing this nine times each direction. After you've done that, then you're going to do the other side. Also make sure you're keeping your lower back area open. So as you sink down, you want to sink into the quad or the hip crease. And then you're letting the lower back relax and open instead of letting the upper body bow forward. So you want to keep that alignment as well. Again, inhale up the front, exhale down the back. This is intention, so you're bringing the intention through the front, down the back. Connect it through your center. done nine times. Coming back to the Wuji stance. Just going to bring the energy back. So inhale to the upper Dantian, center of the head. Exhale to the lower abdomen. You can do that three times on the last one. Embracing your Dantian. And just focus into the Dantian for a moment. Now we're going to move on to the single leg ascending and descending of energy. So going down the outside of your left leg through the bubbling well and then over the toes. Inhale up the bubbling well, up the inside to the Dantian. Exhale down the outside through the bubbling well and then inhale up the inside to the Dantian. Exhale down. Inhale up. Always coming back to the Dantian. with the breath, exhale down, inhale drawing up from the earth, you can feel the perineum pull up and in as you draw up and then let it relax as you go down. Also to make sure you're, if you can sink into the hip crease, sit the hips down a little bit. If that's hard to do you can keep the hips a little bit higher. Exhale down the outside, that's the outside is the yang meridian, inside is the yin meridian. So you're going down the yang meridian, coming up the yin meridian on the inside. And remember this is how you're connecting the intention with the movement. Bringing your mind through that channel. Also helps strengthening the legs, keep the energy open through the hips. We're doing this nine times. want to do less you can do six times and coming back to the Wuji bringing energy back inhaling 
exhaling. Doing that three times and then back to the middle Dantian. Now we're going to do the same exercise except now both legs together. So first one you come up the inside to the Dan up to the Pyrenaeum to the middle Dantian. Exhale down the outside. So inhale up. Exhale down. Again up through the bubbling well, through the Pyrenaeum. Exhale down the outside, Yang channel. Inhale up the inside, Yin channel. Each time, remember coming back to the Dantian, lower abdomen. And go around the waist and then down the outside. And again, we're doing this one nine times as well. Remember, as you draw up, feel your perineum pelvic floor pulling up and in a little bit, drawing energy up, and then let it relax as you go down. And after you've done nine times, coming back to the Wuji stance, bringing energy back once again. Embracing the Dantian, coming back to stillness.